cardiac arrest is basically the the situation where the heart stops and it's a lethal situation because there's no blood flow going to the body. Uh, there are many causes for cardiac arrest, the biggest of which is basically the cardiac, uh, the heart attack. Um, an acute myocardial infarction can lead to cardiac arrest, but there are a lot of other reasons as well that can make the heart stop. Bad rhythms, um, clots in the lungs, trauma, uh, bleeding, all these things can cause the heart to stop. I would say everyone needs to know how to perform CPR. A bystander delivering CPR while is waiting for police or, or fire to arrive at the scene can improve the chances for survival for the patient with cardiac arrest fourfold. So if a patient is receiving bystander CPR at the arrival of the paramedics, he has about a 400% chance compared to if he was not receiving bystander CPR to survive the event. Our goal for the future of resuscitation is mainly to improve the chances for patients um, by optimizing those interventions during the process of taking care of the patients. Uh, we try to optimize the ability to recognize cardiac arrest with public awareness programs. We, we teach everybody CPR as much as we can you know, at schools, at uh, big corporations, um, and we try basically to equip our fire department, police department, and paramedics with the best equipment that is out there in order to provide the best CPR quality that is available. Our efforts are focusing on increasing the, the rate um, by which bystanders provide CPR while they're waiting for more professional help to arrive. The American Heart Association, the Minnesota Resuscitation Consortium, and other resuscitation um, entities are focusing on bystander CPR because that is the most important predictor for survival.